再见了，相互嫌弃的老同学，再见了，来不及说出的谢谢。Hi, and let's learn some Chinese. I'm Stephanie, and welcome to my channel. It is that time of the year when we see a lot of students graduated from universities. So to them, I'll say, 祝贺你们，你们毕业了。祝贺你们，你们毕业了。Congratulations on your graduation. So in this episode, we are going to learn some graduation-related Chinese. Let's get started. The first one I've just mentioned, 祝贺。祝贺 means congratulations or congratulations. 跟我读祝贺祝贺祝贺你们祝贺你们 Congratulations to you guys. If I want to say congratulations to you, it would be 祝贺你 Very simple. 祝贺你们你们毕业了毕业 means graduation means you graduated. But what if you are referring to people who are going to graduate at that year? In Chinese, we call them. 毕业生 you know this 生 from 学生 student. So 毕业生 means the student who are about to graduate this year. 毕业生毕业生 Now you can say 我今年毕业 I graduated this year. 我今年毕业我 If I want to say I'm going to graduate next year, how do you say that? It's very simple. Do you know the word for tomorrow? So today is 今天 okay, and this year is 今年 So tomorrow is 明天 and next year is 明年 So if you say 我今年毕业 which means I graduated this year. If you want to say next year, 我对我明年毕业我明年毕业 So if you want to say I graduated last year, 我去年毕业了 or 我去年毕业的 So If you wanted to say you belong to the class of 2020 and you graduated this year, you can say 我是二零二零届毕业生 So 届 here means year, and it's widely used when it referring to which year you graduated or the conference, the annual conference thing. For example, if you are joining those alumni conference or alumni reunion. What more often people will ask you instead of 你哪一年毕业的 which year you graduated, they would more commonly seen to ask you 你是哪一届的 or 你哪一届毕业的 So it is this word 届 We've been talking about college graduates. What about、uh, elementary graduates or high school graduates? It's very easy. You just use the word 毕业生 Of course, you would want to put the school in front. So let's take a look at how to say these schools in Chinese. It's very easy. So if I tell you the university, we call them as 大学 So 学 is study, learning, 大学 So can you guess? Give me a wild but educated guess. What would the elementary school be? 小学 we call them 小学 So you have the elementary school, 小学 university, 大学 and then you can put the middle. Together, so 中学 which means middle school. Now high school is slightly different. It borrows the characters from the middle school. We call them 高中高中 So we have 小学中学高中 and then 大学 And of course, if you wanted to say I'm an elementary student, you just put 生 next to it. It's like 毕业生 So you say 小学生中学生高中生大学生 Now moving on to the graduate school, we call them 研究生研究生 Now if you got your PhD, 祝贺你 We call them 博士生博士生 So that's it for today's episode. If you like this video, feel free to share it with your friends. And if you like my video, make sure you subscribe so next time you know when I upload a new video. And thank you for watching. Next time I will talk about some job-related words, and I'll see you next episode. Bye.